Hey everyone, Oakland District 3 Councilmember Lynette Gibson McElhaney has been talking to her friends and associates about running for mayor of Oakland. She is not at all ready to make this public, but she is definitely lining up her supporters and trading support for the idea that the person will help her on her mayoral bid when she announces it. What I mean by trading support, I mean she'll support their effort if they in turn back her for mayor. Now, it's still early in the game. The only officially listed person running for mayor of Oakland is the current mayor, Libby Schaff, according to the City of Oakland elections website as of July 24th, 2017. The election race doesn't start heating up until November, really December, with respect to what the next year's slate of candidates will be. So it's still early, but Lynette Gibson McElhaney is definitely making it known to her friends and supporters that she is really seriously considering a run for mayor. Now the question is, can she win? Right now, you'd have to give her a 50-50 chance. And I'm not saying that because Mayor Schaff is the only challenger, but because of how her supporters line up versus the mayor's supporters versus the fact that the Oakland electorate is changing dramatically with a lot of new people moving in, replacing people moving out, but then, of course, a number of homeless people who, I would guess, are still very eligible to vote. And that really brings an entire element to be considered in this election that has never existed before in large numbers. A homeless voting population. In fact, how do you manage that? Can a person vote if they don't have a conventional address? Well, they would have to go by the address. Let's let's consider that. The answer is yes. Because the voting system only considers the last place you were eligible, where you lived at, when you were eligible to vote. That means if a person is, if you will, newly homeless within the last year, their voting right is still active. It's still active. And if they are located in Oakland, that is a built-in constituency that you would have to say is going to be against Oakland Mayor Libby Schaff. There's no question about it. So Mayor Schaff has to hope, as do the other council members, that that number of people doesn't grow. And then let's look at it another way. Right now, Oakland Council Member and let Gibson McElhaney manages, if you will, District 3. District 3 is the site of one of the largest homeless encampments, if not the largest one in Oakland. Will they serve to be a negative vote against the current sitting council member who they could perceive as not doing anything to help them? She's an incumbent like the mayor. That would leave it open for a third challenger. So, but with the two of them, it would. that's why I say it's 50-50, okay? But that's where it sits right now. Oakland Councilmember Libby, Sh uh, Libby Schaff, excuse me, she was a council member in, in uh, District 4 in 2010. Oakland Councilmember Lynette Gibson McElhaney is putting her ducks in a row, seriously considering running for mayor of Oakland.